Thankfully, it's November, and Appalachian Wireless is offering the Samsung GS8 or the GS8 Plus for $100 off the regular price with two-year agreement. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless and East Kentucky Network Company. For nearly three decades, Rick Bartley has served in the Pike County Commonwealth's Attorney's Office, including the past 17 years as Commonwealth's Attorney. Next year will be his last. Bartley, before family, friends, and law enforcement and legal colleagues, announced Wednesday that he will not seek re-election in 2018. My term will end December the 31st of 2018. The election will be in May and in November, so I've got a year to go on my term. I intend to serve that. Unless things change drastically, uh, it's my intention to be here for the next year. Bartley said that upon retirement, he will have served for more than 27 years. The Commonwealth's attorney sets a standard for what's going to be prosecuted and how they're going to be prosecuted, what's going to be tolerated, and what's not going to be tolerated. And it's a, it's a great job in that sense, but it has a lot of responsibility. So when you're choosing who's going to be your next Commonwealth attorney, keep all those things in mind. Kentucky's embattled retirement system factored into his decision. They're proposing that after your 27 years while you're working, you'll be automatically shifted over to a 401k type plan. I'm not interested in that at all. And so the uncertainty around the pensions and the probability that your pension's not going to increase after 27 years has caused me to say, yeah, it's time to hang it up also. Bartley stopped just short of shutting the door on future public service, saying he's not sure what the future holds beyond retirement. As for his service as Commonwealth's attorney, he said he's proud of the work he's done, and he's looking forward to one more year in office. In the last 17 years, I've prosecuted approximately 6,000 felony cases along with my staff here in Pike County. They range from, as all of you know, really serious murder cases and assaults to you know, less serious thefts and little burglars and things. But I have tried to stress to my staff, and I have tried to treat all those people involved as if it were their only case, because in fact it is to them. One of the things that we were told as new prosecutors was it is not our job or our duty to seek convictions. It is the duty of the Commonwealth's attorney to seek justice. And I tried to really take that to heart. Maybe justice and convictions are the same thing, but not always. At the Pike County Judicial Center, Chris Anderson, EKB News.